Welcome back guys to another progress for the hardcore group Iron Man series in which we go for all the PVM drops and in today's episode I finally worked my way towards barrels all the prep is done in this episode and we are going in with still pretty low stats but it was well worth it just to get that early barrels going for the motivation if you do end up enjoying this video make sure to like the video and subscribe because we're going really hard this entire month so you'll be seeing a lot more PVM throughout this series not just skilling and all that you know actual dangerous things Ooh, look at that those prayer pots coming handy from all the herbs i gave mutts and he also hooked me up with the agility potion for Tybo wanted thank you sweet cheeks appreciate it appreciate it all right i'm gonna hook this boy up with some manor seeds too for maestro so yo 55 magic let's go all right i'm done with magic training High level Alk is the big boy moneymaker. I'll Alk at least one. Oh, yes. Instantly got all my money back just from that one Alk. Yeah, next thing is training my range up a bit. Hell yeah. 25 farming. Yeah, these seaweeds. Good XP. Oh, his spore too. What the frick? Damn. 200 law runes. Oh, I can just spam this shit whenever I want now. Teleportation is no longer a drag by this point. Oh shit, just got another granite shield. Damn. They're like the rarest ones. I don't even have a single rune kite. <laughs> uh. Oh my dude, how am I getting four granite shields without a single rune kite? Or a rune warhammer even. Yo, these shields are twice as rare as a rune kite shield, man. Oh, yeah, I'm just gonna alk all these fucking uh, granite shields. Oh, damn, bro. I love these freaking ice trolls, dude. We're almost at 200k. All right, we're gonna meet up with Mutz real quick because he has access to the farming guild, which means he can buy burr house seeds a lot better than what I can at Draenor. So, the main is a pivotal part of most men's looks and confidence. However, hair loss is a very common phenomenon that happens to most adults, male, by the age of 35. As a male in my 20s, it is apparent that my hair has thinned a lot over the years too. But, what if it is possible to keep our hair? Luckily, hair loss prevention exists and Keeps is the premium hair prevention service. The Keeps subscription service includes connecting you with a certified doctor who will tailor and send the right prescription every 3 months to your doorstep. You also have 24-7 access to your Keeps doctor to address any questions and concerns. The earlier you start your hair prevention, the more hair you can save. Check out some of these testimonials from Keeps customers. The Rice Fields, in collaboration with Keeps, is offering a 50% discount on your first order. Start saving your luscious hair now by clicking on my link, keeps.com slash ricecup, in the description. Thanks for listening. Back to the progress. First time uh, going to the sandstone mine, but uh, yeah, it's been pretty good. Ah, I see. Claim sand. Oh, and that's where the money comes in. All right, well, I want all, all of it, so. Damn, that is a bit expensive. I am fairly well off, but dang, that, that costed a bit. My teammate Mutz got me some extra teak logs so that I can make better burr houses with them. So, three tick poggers. Yo, thank you, bro. Okay, we started this. It's time to get ourselves some mythical gloves, cause man, I, I don't have any good mage melee gloves, so wanna at least do some barrels in style with some mythical gloves. Should be really quick with some teleports available now. Forty one for recipe for disaster. Yeah, shout out Vera for this uh, spot though, cause I totally forgot these guys sell a bunch of raw fish that is right up my alley, so. This is good. This is good. Wow, my estimates were always so close, man. How long? Holy crap, the clutch, man. Yo, let's go. Mithril gloves, baby. Actually, I can get adamant gloves. Next time this kitten goes uh, to cat, I, I will uh, definitely do the uh, Dave recipe quest. And I can upgrade to adamant, so. Man, if I knew it was going to take this long. 44 prayer. I just wanted to get this real quick. 
Because I'm about to do something pretty ballsy. Inspired by the, the Twisted League grind that I used to do. So I really want to get a magic short bow so I can kill Aaron's with it instead of the bone crossbow because I know the DPS will be so much better. And I was thinking maybe I can do some quick hard clues and hopefully get that. It's not a super rare drop, but the problem is at my level range getting hard clues isn't easy. So I was hoping maybe I could find a mob that I can range and get some hard clues. And I remember Twisted League, there were these zombie skeletons in Shajin Crypt that only have 50 HP, can hit 19s though, and are very dangerous because it's multi. But they are quick to kill, and the drop rate is 1 in 100 for hard clues. So I want to give it a try. I can, apparently. Apparently I can hit these guys. Nice, nice. They're not that tanky. They they do hit really hard, though. Oh, wait. I'm on a zombie task, actually. This is perfect. <laughs> oh, I forgot I'm on a zombie task. And I have 57 of them, so that gives me hella incentive to be here. I get Slayer levels, and I get Clue Scrolls and shit. Okay, let's fucking try it out, you know. Let's go ahead and try it. Oh, room at home. Hell yeah. That's my best in slot. Oh. Holy shit. Ow. Bruh, 19, dude. Come on. 23 Slayer. Sweet. Oh, I got a hard clue scroll. Oh my god. Can I even do this? <laughs> of course I can't do it. Ah, oh, damn, bro. Oh man, I already got a clue scroll, but I can't even do it. Oh shit. Like that's like a guarantee you can't do it too. Oh my god, another hard clue. No way. Oh yes, dude. Oh wait, this is a safe spot, yo. Wait, this uh these ogres. Wait, they're not aggressive? Sweet. Okay, okay. Alright, alright. I think this is a safe spot, so let's give it a shot here. Oh yo, safe spot! You just got safe spotted, sucker. Get wrecked. Here we go. The moment of truth. Will you bless me, sir? Mr. Reen Descartes. Bless me? Yo, casket! Alright, moment of truth. Magic shortbow, yay or nay. Here we go. Oh my god, it's not a magic shortbow, but I just got full rune, though. I'll take it, but it's not a magic shortbow. It's not a magic shortbow, but I just got, like, full rune. <laughs> I mean, I needed I needed this, so I needed the full rune for barrels, I guess. Ah, dang it, man. No magic short bow. That means I'm gonna have to kill Scuffed Aram. I have to kill Scuffed Aram with uh, a bone crossbow. Oof. Another hard clue? Uh, okay. I mean, I'll, I'll try. I'll try it, man. I'll try. <laughs> Yo, are you sure these are 1 in 100 rates? They feeling like a one in there, one in five, man. Let's see, barrels gloves. Oh, I mean admin gloves, sick. Wow, huh? <laughs> I guess the uh, myth gloves didn't last too long. So I tried to cook my seaweed earlier to train crafting, but my cooking was so low that it wouldn't actually give me the proper amount of soda ash. Because if you fail, you only get one. But at around forty cooking. That's when it started getting a lot better, so I started doing it now. Dude, okay, well, 45 crafting's done. I overestimated. <laughs> I made so many mulling glass. Yeah, I might as well just go higher. Yes, 50 range magic short bow is in this list here of things I unlocked. And yes, we still have the hard clue, the second one that we might be able to open. So, I've got to prep just in case, but also I just need higher range, because Aram's going to be pretty challenging. Oh! Nice. God damn, fruit trees are so fat. Yo, you can thank all them burr houses, man, because these fruit trees be banging. Yes! That was scary, though, because this guy kept hitting tens, and I only have salmon. But, yeah, Ring of Recoil came in clutch, though. Yay, Dragon Slayer done. And that's gonna give me some nice, much needed stat boost. Come on, Clue Scroll? 
Oh, shit. Nice. We can literally just do the clue scroll right then and there without finishing the quest. But I'm going to finish the quest. Casket, please. No, another clue step. No way, dude. Oh, wait. Please kill it. Yes. Let's go. Good thing I did not pull a mammal. Yeah. Nice. Oh, ho, ho. those good. That's good. 56 hit points. Let's go. Okay, let's try to finish this hard clue. Oh, I did it! Yes, dude. I can't believe that, bro. From 50 zombies, I managed to get six hard clues or something, or maybe even seven. And I managed to get two of them done. Like, it, it's nothing short of a miracle. Okay, here we go, boys. Magic short bow, please. No, not a magic short bow. <laughs> Whoa, what? Why is this 300k? What the hell? But I got Black Dehyde Chaps though, but dang it, not a magic short bow. No. It's time to get the Ivan Staff for barrels, and the stupid grid puzzle part of Underground Pass was so troll because I started from right to left, and I failed every single one except obviously the left one, and then it turned out it was all left tiles. That was correct. Oh, hell yeah, all left. That's easy to remember. This guy's such a forehead. Okay, telegram. Save myself from having to go through that stupid bridge. Yes! Let's freaking go, bro. Didn't even take that long. Guess what, baby? 35 agility. Oh, actually, 26 out of 35 agility. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go ahead and um, spend 200,000 to upgrade my Ivan Staff. Yeah, yeah, let's do it, man. I'm gonna be a broke man. No, actually, no, I, I have a lot of deference still, so I'm gonna sell some deference. Let me give you guys some highlights of what my teammates are doing during this episode. So, Mr. Mutz, he's building up a lot of cash by doing LMS. And we really don't need everybody doing it at the moment, so he's kind of like the one taking charge of that. And he's providing most of the financial income, as you can see. He's got the points from, yeah, doing pretty good job at killing people, LMS, and uh, buying rune arrows and selling to stores for the money. <laughs> sorry, that was very loud. That was very loud. I'm sorry. That was very loud. And we have Fuse here investing in getting us the good, good food. Karen Bonds is the goal, so he's doing Temporos to 65 and opening the loots and then providing us some Karen Bonds and whatever loot he gets. Another tome, bro. Another, boys, we're sharing the tomes around here. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Oh, this is gonna be nice. I'm gonna take the, uh, tome, I'm gonna take the tome of water, honestly, because... What I can do is, it'll give me some magic bonus too. Because I don't have anything with magic bonus, so. So yeah, this will give me an extra A magic. Hell yeah. Cool. I'll take it. Definitely going to be useful at Barrows. Okay, now we can finish the quest. Yes, Shades of Morn done. Now I can use the teleports. Minigame teleport to get here. They changed it. Uh, now it's this weird looking symbol. Now you're about to uh, go into a different family or something. But yeah, we can use the teleport. Let's just test it real quick. My character should be able to do it. Yeah, it works. Okay. So we're going to try some barrels. But this setup is really bad. <laughs> it's god awful. I mean, the Ivan staff is good, but... I'm just concerned about Arams, honestly. Like, how, how long is this going to take to kill this guy? All right, the most dangerous of them all. Uh, I'm definitely just not even going to bother prayer flicking. I am just going to keep my um, prayer on this whole time. Just because this guy can literally one shot me if my prayer just goes down even a little bit. Even at zero once. Ooh, that felt good. That felt good, man. Oh, th there's like a stall. Actually, no, I don't want to flick this because if I lag even once, I'm asking to die. So we're not going to do Let's be honest. Sweet. It's quite a lot safer if I just safe spot the melee brothers downstairs. So instead of just finding them in their tombs, yeah, I can just go to a corner room and 
use the rooms that is on the corner and also the long haul to trap the melee guys as you can see and that way I can never take damage even if I lag or DC or whatever. Here we go boys, bone crossbow arums, how are we doing? How's this going? How's this going man? Yo, we can do this! Yo, actually bone crossbow ain't that bad. I'm not even gonna front. Bone crossbow wasn't that bad. It took me two per uh, per doses though. Nah, no one, nobody did win a Todd. So there we go, first loot. Here we go, instant open. Oh, <laughs> yo, let's go, dude. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Worth it. We got one of the best items. Easy money, bro. <laughs> okay, let's bring the one click tab. Oh my god. And I can I even do this? I can't. I can. There's no way, Sherlock. Yo, fucking hell, dude. <laughs> Rex home, bro. Oh my god. We just got we just got one of the best items. I freaking insta looted that shit. Yo, 14 minutes of run, guys. Not bad, not bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> Woo, baby. That's nice. Alright, okay, we're gonna bring the one click tell you though. Slow barrels equal stuff. Hell yeah. Number two. Here we go, number two. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, I wish, you know, I wish uh, we could continue the back-to-back, -back, but but it's all good. Alright, we got what we wanted. We wanted a drop and we got it, so let's uh, train our Slayer a little bit. Get our HP up a bit higher, you know, get the stats a bit higher before we go back. I want at least 60 HP, at least. Alright guys, I think I'm gonna wrap up this video at this point just because I am going to be kind of just chilling a bit uh, Because I am feeling a bit tired going straight from combat achievements to sweaty group environment, but um, We're getting some really good stats for melee right now gonna get 65 strength and attack so I can do warriors guild in the next episode for the defenders And also work on 58 slayer and in between will be a bit of questing because we still have a lot more questing to do eventually for barrels gloves, right? And also some barrels. We'll be doing some barrels gradually every day. You know, get safer and safer stats to do barrels. Since we're not necessarily in a rush to get the equipment anyways. But for fun, you know, just to spice it up. But yeah, that'll be what it's all about next video. Now, let's talk about my other teammates uh, and their stats and progression. Alrighty, let's do our uh, quick summary. So we're still rank 15 uh, overall for skilling. Which again, it's, you know, not that big for us. In terms of importance, but yeah, 2,765 total. Alright, so... Uh, now, I've contributed the uh, second most XP, but that's just because I've been AFKing a lot of combat stats and training combat, so the XP or per hour there is a lot better than uh, other skills. Uh, we have freaking Fuse going hard on cooking. Yeah, you get such a big deal on cooking because he's been fishing so much Karen Bonds. Um, he just did Temporas, and yeah, he did a lot of... Um, Karen Bond fishing and <laughs> and yeah now his cooking is crazy so he beefed up his XP because of that but yeah he is rushing barrels uh, and also let's look at Mutz here the least amount of XP but he is really building up those skills though he's at 922 total oh wow we're all really similar but um he's focusing a lot on the song of the else again it's it's a little really long term commitment we're talking like 200 plus hours of prep just to uh, quote unquote rush it. So yeah, he's building up a lot of his uh, skilling stats for the quest, as you can see. 